Have you ever felt attracted to a man and not known why? Or have you ever had feelings for someone you didn't want to like? What's going on here? Why does this happen? These experiences hint at a hidden world that drives our attraction to romance. That hidden world is about emotional reactions. Emotional reactions that we can't consciously control. The truth is, falling in love with someone is not something we choose to do. It's more like thirst. You don't choose to be thirsty. You just notice it. And the stronger your thirst becomes, the harder it gets to ignore. What if I told you that all men have a relationship thirst they can't quench on their own? Would you want to know what they crave? To skip straight to the answer, click this video and reveal how you can trigger his thirst for something he needs and wants. Plus, I'll tell you how to ensure that you are the only person he relies on to satisfy this intense craving. This video is about a strange need that men have in love called the hero instinct. This is a need that makes him feel like a provider, a protector, and an admirer. If a woman can trigger his hero instinct, he'll feel a strong attraction and commitment to her. But here's the problem. He can't tell you what he craves because he feels embarrassed to admit the truth. And admitting this desire actually makes him move away from his goal. Why is that? Let me give you an example. Imagine a woman who feels frustrated because her man never does anything romantic. She finally snaps and explains to him her desire to feel pursued and cherished by him. But he acts like she's being unreasonable and asks her to spell out what she's missing. So she gives him an example. It would be nice to get some flowers once in a while. Just something simple like that. The next day, he brings her flowers. But the gesture lacks magic. Because when you have to ask someone to give you flowers, getting them doesn't feel special anymore. Men are the same way, only on a completely different relationship need. You see, men have an endless thirst for your admiration, but he can't ask for it. He can't say, Julie, I really like you, but there's something missing in our relationship. You don't admire me enough. You seem to admire other men in your life more, and that makes it hard for me to imagine a future with you. He can't say these words because men believe admiration is something they have to earn. Asking for admiration is like trying to become popular by announcing you are a cool person. It doesn't work that way. He only feels like your hero when you communicate your admiration with nonverbal language. He has to read it between the lines of what you actually say and do. Now you might be thinking, that's not so strange. I can understand why a man would crave admiration. But if you're thinking that way, I have something important to tell you. It's not just that men crave admiration, it's that he can't sustain that love feeling without it. Nothing kills a man's attraction faster than a relationship where he doesn't feel needed. He wants to see himself as provider, someone who is admired because of his ability. You see, if he doesn't feel needed, he feels like less of a man, emasculated. And that turns off his romantic drive. And the worst part? You can't just give him admiration. It only works if he believes he has earned your trust, admiration, and respect. But here's the good news. It's both fun and easy to let him be your hero once you know how to do it right. All it takes is finding ways for him to be your hero. Of course, there's an art to making him feel like a hero in an authentic way. But as a relationship coach, I've seen what works and what doesn't work. But it boils down to this. You need to trigger his hero instinct. Do that and you'll be astonished by what happens next. He'll become so loving, so attentive, and so committed to being with you for the long term that you'll never want to go back to the way things were before. The hero instinct is a subconscious drive that makes him gravitate toward people who make him feel like a hero, but it's amplified in his romantic relationships. Some ideas really are life-changing when it comes to romance and for better or worse, this is one of them. That's why I've created an online video presentation so you can claim this secret as your own. Because triggering his hero instinct is one thing, but learning how to do it over and over again requires some tips and tricks. The fact is, women don't need someone to rescue them, especially in this day and age. 
yet here's the ironic truth. Men still need someone to rescue them because it's built into their DNA to seek out relationships that allow them to feel like a provider. This one tiny difference in male and female genetics creates a huge difference in what attracts men to the opposite sex. He's drawn to any woman who allows him to step into the role of a hero. Because his instincts naturally cause him to thirst for that social role, here's something cool about this. He won't even know why he's so addicted to you. That's because you're triggering this attraction at a subconscious level. He'll feel an undeniable pull to his emotions for you. But if his friends ask him why he's so crazy about you, he won't be able to explain it. If that sounds like fun to you, click the link below to learn more about this relationship enhancement tool. It's something you can learn once, but then use for the rest of your life.